Hi, Dennis Ray here. You make a video, but there's a part of it that you don't want people to see and you'd like to blur it out. In this video, I'll show you an easy way of doing that with the great and free video editor shortcut. As an example, I'll use this intro with the wonderful message on this t-shirt, play, dance, and read. Let's get started. The first thing we want to do is to take our video put it into Shotcut, into the playlist, and then drag it down to the timeline. Next, you can go up to Filters. Then, uh, well, you have tabs for the playlist and filters, but in Filters, you can hit the plus sign. In Video tab, you look for three things. We're going to look for Mask, Simple Shape, you can click on that and then back up to Blur Box, click on that and back down to Mask Apply. You can click on that. And uh, instead of looking down the list, you can do a search on them. And once you've clicked on them, they'll show up in your favorites. And, uh, you have Mask. Simple shape, apply, and blur box. In my spare time, I love watching baby goat videos on YouTube. Well, I don't have any kid goats in my video, but watch it all anyway. Then like and subscribe. After that, you can watch baby goat videos. They're just too darn cute. So in the filters, I can go ahead and click on the different filters in this order. Mask, simple shape, and then down to plus, blur box, down to plus again, mask apply, and then up to mask simple shape. And you see this box here, I can move this anywhere on the screen where I want to blur. And I wanted to blur this on my t-shirt, so I'll go ahead and move that over that. Okay, very good. And uh, over here, uh, you have some selections about the shape. It can be ellipse, triangle, diamond, but I'm gonna leave it at rectangle. And you can change the positions with these settings or the size with these settings. And uh, you can also rotate it, the distortion or the blur or the softness, but I'm going to leave that in the default positions. And then go to the blur box. And you see it's blurred somewhat there, but I can use these uh, with to change that. So it's blurred a little bit more, the height and the width. Oh, that's pretty good. So then Hit Mask Apply, go to Export, and I can hit that, Export it, and it's saved. This is the result of the blurring in the video. Shotcut did a great job of blurring, and it really is an easy process. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. We will see you next time. Take care. Bye.